guys! Welcome back to my channel. Jashana here to talk about some friggin' library porn today. So I initially was thinking about like getting really in depth with this and for every library I talk about like giving a little paragraph of facts about it, but uh, then I decided no. So this is just 10 of my favorite, my personal favorite, like libraries around the world. I will have linked below the various like lists, like articles with the lists of cool libraries or awesome libraries uh, down below so you guys can check it out. I mean, there's tons more as I'm sure many of you already know and have looked at before because again, library porn, love it. So I'll just list them and post a little picture and if I have anything to say about it, I will, but I'm not getting all in depth. The first one is probably the most aesthetically pleasing library I've ever freaking seen. It's, uh, it's, it's magical. But this is Wiblingen Abbey in Germany. And holy mother freaking crap, look at this. Like, I just, I can't, I can't. Like it's all rainbowy and like just beautiful. The next one is the library in the castle, which is at El Escorial in Madrid, Spain. And this one I do have a little fun fact about because I have been here. I've been to this library, I've been to El Escorial, and it's freaking awesome. Like, there's so much cool stuff about El Escorial, but the library in particular was really awesome. But the library is beautiful very like old world majestic. Another one that is very like old world majestic, but more scholarly looking to me is the Trinity College Library in Dublin, Ireland. I have seen this one quite a bit on like Instagram and stuff. And yeah, it's just so like classic looking, you know? For a more modern one, which maybe this is your jam, maybe it's not. I still think it looks cool. It's not necessarily one of my favorites, but as far as a, a super sleek, modern look goes, it's really awesome. And that is, I think it's Stuttgart. It might be Stuttgart, Stuttgart Library in Stuttgart, Germany. As you can see, it's very clean lines, very, very modern, and pretty cool looking though. This next one is probably tied with the uh, Wiblingen Abbey Library as far as like being aesthetically pleasing. And that is the library at Admont Abbey in Austria because tell me this does not look like Belle's library, like Belle from Beauty and the Beast, like the, her library, right? Like, can you not see her in this library? I need to see myself in this library. Number six on the list is one that I honestly haven't seen too many pictures of the inside, actually, but the outside of this library is very cool. And that is Vancouver Public Library in Vancouver, Canada. As you can see, like on the outside, it looks like almost like Coliseum-y, but then the overhead view, you can see like the building separately inside, like the grass and like little park almost it looks like on the top, like on the roof. And I just thought it was super cool looking. Number seven is the picture book library in I Iwaki, Iwaki City, Japan. And this one started out just as a little, a library for like, I think like one school like nearby for the, lo the little kids. Um, and now it's like a citywide thing, but it's just super unique. All the books, it's all picture books and they're all like facing out like that. My only thing is I'm like, well, how do, you, how do you get some of them that are like up high? I don't know, they must have ladders and stuff. This one I think would be just kind of, for me personally, I, like being a history lover, I feel like I'd be kind of overwhelmed just with like how special and like the magnitude of it. This is the Beinecke Rare Book Library in New Haven, Connecticut. Like, can we just like, oh my God, like that glassed in tower in there, that's all the rare books in there. And then another one that I have been to is the New York Public Library, uh, but this is actually specifically the Stephen A. Schwartzman building, which I didn't know what, there was like a separate thing. I just went into the Astor Hall, like main entrance of the library, which you can see here. And they have like the little bookstore and they had like a uh, art display going on or something. And then I went upstairs and they have like the rare book rooms where you have to like sign in 
and only certain people are allowed in and a certain number of people at a time like in each room and that was really cool but I didn't get to see like the main library part which I'm pretty bummed about but whatever I still got to go and then we could not talk about awesome worldwide libraries without mentioning Bibliotheca Alexandria in Egypt in Alexandria Egypt so as we know the um, you know great library of Alexandria was like done away with many many moons ago fires etc it just like withered away to nothing um, and I believe I had looked up some information I think it was 2002 or 2012 that this new library was um, built and everything and it's pretty freaking cool looking too as you can see here's the outside of it pretty awesome and then on the inside it looks pretty cool too with that like slanted roof and everything let me know in the comments down below what one was your favorite out of these 10 and if there's any others that you've seen that are your favorite that weren't on this list because I mean like I said there's tons check the links below all right thank you so much for your time guys always appreciate it and I will talk to you next time bye bye